Today is Apple Day. We were going, but we're actually not going anymore. And because they have it in stock at Best Buy. And you're probably like, what's in stock at Best Buy? What does this have to do with Apple Day? Okay, what am I doing? I remember I was like, I'm not gonna, oh no, I took this part out of the video. But I was like, I'm not gonna get the iPhone. I need to learn to be, learn to get not, learn that I don't, that I don't need to get everything as soon as I want it. Well, <laughs> no, so this is what happened. My mom wanted to know what to give me for my birthday. And I was like, well, I'll just get the new phone. So my mom got mine for my birthday. But then she got one because she had an upgrade and they were having a deal where the phone was free. My sister was asleep at the time. And so we didn't even end up telling her till later. And so yeah, she was like, I want one too. Why? Out of all three of us, my phone is coming in last. Y'all almost had heart failure. It doesn't matter. Mine is last and like way at the end of October. But it might come early. I don't know. And guess who's coming first? Guess who's is coming first? Nia's! The one who wasn't even supposed to get a phone. I'm over it. But now we're going to Best Buy because Noah, can you do this for me? I should charge taxes on her. A working fee. But so today's Best Buy Apple Day. I actually went to Apple yesterday, but they didn't have it. So now we're going to Best Buy. Today. So it's Best Buy Day. I made this up. I say it's Apple Day because the phone is available today. about to try this place called ugly donuts and corn dogs i don't know if, i don't know like it's like those weird corn dogs with like the potato and stuff on it i don't know i don't know what i'm getting myself into y'all i'm probably about to die out here they're gonna have to bury me out here at this shopping center but anyways y'all if y'all do want to try this i've never oh okay yeah that's always it is right i think i'm right so this is like those korean because i was gonna say this but i didn't want to be wrong and then people come to my house and kill me but these are like those korean hot dog things corn dogs yeah i don't know i was gonna try these the other day when i was out here but i did not we're going to try them today and hopefully it's good so i thought i'd show you this is like on one side of the wall and then on the other side it has like the potato corn dog thing those don't look appetizing at all to me so i don't know looks freaking delicious it looks so freaking delectable it smells really freaking good it looks really freaking good i don't know if i should have sat over here though because it's like really dark and these fans sound like i'm on a freaking airplane i'm moving i'm moving we have moved even though this is probably like a thousand times worse because it has like okay wait i think that my camera's dirty like they should click this water off like nobody's even here it's like 11 in the morning it is so angelic and so beautiful. It's like a half hot dog, half cheese, potato, and spicy mayo. It's burning up hot now. I think I made a horrible decision of moving over here. But let's try this Korean corn dog. I haven't eaten anything today. It's good. I can't take it, y'all. I can't take it. How is anyone living out here? How people alive out here? When they have sugar on it? I don't know if it's like a franchise or what. I've never heard of it. This location that I'm in is in the, the freak. I'm like dying. So the apocalypse, the apocalypse, the end of the world, my fate, eating a Korean corn dog and dying. This location is in Perilyn, the Perilyn Town Center, if you know what that is, if you're, yeah. Oh no, it looks like I ate all the cheese, now it's time for the dog. Their spicy mayo is so freaking good. Their spicy mayo is like literally making me want to slap my mom, slap my mom. Right now the cheese part, 10 out of 10. I had to pay extra for the potato to, for them to put that on there, but I always see them with the potato. So I was like, I have, like, I can't not, I can't get this and not get the potato. But let's go ahead and try the dog part. <laughs> I don't know if I'm feeling the dog part. I don't know. Like the type of hot dog. I don't know. This is a lot. This is a lot. I really don't even want the whole thing. Plus, I didn't even take my vitamins today, so I'm not even hungry. Y'all! What is this? What is that all coming from? Where were y'all gonna tell me that Jamba has boba? I heard there's just a whole thing of cheese. And give me a Korean corn, a Korean cheese dog. Y'all, I did not eat the whole corn dog. I didn't realize it was like, tell you this is the corn dog. It was like cheese, dog, cheese, dog. Or cheese, winner, cheese, winner. Or however, cheese, sausage, cheese, or whatever. I didn't really care for the sausage part. So, the cheese part, and I said like 10 out of 10, I was just eating it. I was just happy. I think, I don't know. But I'll probably give it like a 7 out of 10. 
like even if it did if it just had all maybe like a six out of ten even if it did all just have cheeks i probably would not get it again i wouldn't get it again so probably like a four out of ten <laughs> so my life is falling apart i literally almost died wednesday and changed my major <laughs> i was about to say i almost cried but i was like i really i'm not a cry like, every time i say like i'm gonna cry i'm gonna cry yeah, i'm lying because i like it's so hard for me to cry i don't cry I and mean, i never cry the last time i cried was when my cousin passed away and i don't even remember when i cried before that like it's like i never cry like so when i say i'm about to cry i'm not gonna cry but when i say I cried. I did not cry. So it's just like a little exaggeration. As of right now, I have a midterm to go take and I have an essay to write. That's just gonna occupy the rest of my day. I'll let you know what I make on the midterm. Why not? Unless it's like really horrible. I'll never speak of it again. You'll never know. chat let's chat it's actually like about to be 12 o'clock in the morning everybody's about to go to sleep i wasn't planning on about to talk to y'all but i guess i'll talk to y'all because like what else is there for me to do remember the shoes that i kept telling y'all that i was trying to get i got them i was uh, i was about to clean my room and then i was like what because it is kind of dirty like yeah, I, i'm literally buying too much stuff and i can't store it anywhere my plan is to get a bookshelf i wasn't gonna do a video of like building a bookshelf but that's too much work i'm gonna just end up buying one but i want a bookshelf to go over here because i need i need to display my books and i've been buying things to display on it like my legos so like i've literally been buying too much stuff y'all so i'm gonna show you this in a little bit this to go on my my bookshelf when i do get it y'all i don't even know when i'm getting it i don't know i might end up just going to ikea to get one these are the shoes y'all they're Adi the adidas samba vegans i don't want to be that person that just buys stuff i didn't want to be that person that like bought the whole shoe thing or whatever and then resold them on goat because I, I accidentally bought an extra pair not accidentally i wanted to use my coupon i ordered one pair and then they sent me a coupon but i didn't check it in time so i didn't already order the other pair so then i canceled it or ordered it again use my coupon cheap broke i was like i should have just kept one pair and then resold them on go this is the shoe y'all this is the sound like this is the one i really 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 wanted was the black i ordered the black first i was like i want the white but i'm just waiting and get the white if it ever comes back in stock y'all the white was in stock too at the same time i was just like i'm just about to go ahead and get it because i know i'm gonna end up wanting it. this is the white i wore the white today i don't like keeping shoe boxes usually i keep shoe boxes for some shoes but i'm running out of room to even put shoes y'all i don't have room in my closet like it's time to move out this house i'm outgrowing this room i really am i need to move i'm not moving out i'm poor so my mom needs to buy us a man I like to keep my boxes until I wear the shoes at least once and then I'll throw the boxes away. Wasn't even planning on getting these. Smell kind of weird. I don't know if it's because they're vegan or what. Like it doesn't smell like leather because they're not leather. So back in the day, my dad used to buy these little model cars for me all the time. I wouldn't use them as model cars. I would take them out and play with them. This is the one I bought today. It says it's a 1968 Ford Mustang GT Cobra Jet. But anyways, I'm going to display it on my bookshelf when I get it. I don't have it yet. Still buying stuff and don't have room for anything. My Lego set is actually in my mom's room. I don't have anywhere to put it. This color is so pretty. It's like a spark, like a, not a sparkly, but I guess you could say sparkly metallic i don't know the other car had a flat coat that's why i didn't end up getting that one and it was orange and y'all my favorite color is blue this one just spoke oh i love it my dad used to buy them for me he used to give me at least two or one for my birthday every year along with whatever else he got me but he would always make a tr tradition to get those i don't think you can go like just buy them i've never seen them anywhere but like sam's and i got that one at costco they're like at those type of stores so you might get find it like maybe like bj's or something like i don't i've never been to a bj's but i know it's kind of like similar to sam's so i was like i have to get this because i don't know what end up happening i had a bunch y'all but i used to actually play with them because you can like drive them around they move and stuff the doors open the trunk open the hood open i don't know what i did with them i had like a, i remember i had a i had a mercedes i had a bmw a jeep i have a clip of this horse i pass by this horse every day and i've been meaning to tell y'all about this for weeks and days this horse is literally i don't know if they're just like they don't they're not feeding it enough or they're not feeding it or well, they have to be feeding it because it's alive but the horse is so bony y'all and it like literally breaks my heart every time i drive by i tried to get a clip of y'all for y'all but you can't really see it but the horse is so skinny and so malnourished you can tell or maybe the horse just has high metabolism i don't know but i think it's the people's fault bye like subscribe i'm british